Welcome to CFI's interview prep video series. My name is Mian and I'm the VP of our financial planning and wealth management program here at CFI. And today I'm going to walk you through the top questions for careers in financial planning and wealth management, so generally investment advisor roles. Let's get started. So how do you ensure that your clients make sensible investment decisions? So one of an advisor's main tasks is ensuring that their clients don't fall victim to highly emotional decisions. So fear, greed, panic, hype, and fear of missing out, FOMO, are all very normal reactions for people to experience driven by a variety of triggers. Now, in an interview, you need to convey that you understand the importance of doing proper know your client due diligence and to determine their risk tolerance, investment objectives, and the level of experience they have with different investment vehicles. This allows advisors to ultimately make investment recommendations that are sensible and in line with the client's goals and suitable to the suite of investment solutions that they already have. And additionally, the study of behavioral science has grown in prominence in the industry in recent years, and many firms and advisors have integrated learnings from behavioral science into their onboarding assessments. This allows advisors to learn more about the client's cognitive biases and help them navigate the client in different economic climates. Last but not least, creating that financial plan for each and every client during onboarding is a great way to learn more about them, their goals, risks, and experience, and it'll put the advisor in a much better position to recommend sensible solutions. So how do we wrap all of this up into a interview question response? Let's try it out together. I consider helping my clients make sensible investment decisions one of my core responsibilities as an advisor, and I do this in a number of ways. First of all, during a comprehensive discovery session, I'll collect all of the information from my client that's going to allow me to properly determine their risk tolerance, investment objectives, as well as time horizon. Then these assessments enable me to recommend investment solutions that are both suitable as well as sensible for my client. Secondly, I incorporate a behavioral finance assessment into my onboarding conversation with all of my clients. And this assessment helps me pinpoint some of the behavioral and cognitive biases that most affect my clients, including things like loss aversion, emotional gaps, and herd behavior, all things that we see more and more of in the modern investment landscape. Now, by identifying these biases, I can be prepared for the kinds of conversations, questions, concerns that my clients will raise in volatile markets. Lastly, I reinforce to each of my clients that the service I provide is not for extreme risk taking or for day trading. My practice provides clients with comprehensive wealth management services that are meant to generate consistent long-term risk adjusted returns. I'll set that expectation with every single client that I have from day one. That is a wrap to the top most frequently asked interview questions for careers in wealth management and generally investment advisory services.